very important event where knowledge, curiosity and a healthy competition come together in one platform. Forensic medicine has always been more than a subject. It's a bridge between medicine, law and justice. And quizzes like this not only refresh our understanding of facts, but also sharpen the analytic thinking and probably solving skills that are crucial for future doctors and healthcare professionals. And quizzes like these foster team spirit, encourage collaborative learning, and make academics both engaging and enjoyable. Every question that you attempt Every discussion that you engage in is a step towards strengthening your professional competence. I extend a best wishes to all the teams who will be participating in the quiz and may this quiz inspire you to develop deeper into the fascinating world of forensic medicine and may it ignite in you a lifelong passion for knowledge, truth and justice. With these words, I get the annual forensic quiz open. Thank you. It is not just celebration of knowledge, but also of the spirit of self-directed learning, a cornerstone of competency-based medical education, model envisioned by the National Board of Examiners. The CBNE framework encourages every learner to move beyond passive learning and take charge of their own education, exploring questions and applying concepts of real life scenario. The quiz is a reflection of that philosophy where learning is not confined to textbooks but tested through critical thinking, integration and clinical practice. It has been a pleasure to witness today's mood code enactment. What you present here is not just an academic exercise but a glimpse into the real responsibilities that await you as future doctors. In the legal system, a doctor's testimony is very, very important. It can protect the innocent, bring the justice to the victim and prevent misuse of law. That's the responsibility of the highest order. It has truly been both a privilege and honor to be a part of such an intellectually enriching and truly memorable event. On behalf of Department of Forensic Medicine and Toxicology, I extend my sincere thanks to each one of you for gracing this occasion with your invaluable support and making today's program a resounding success.